Howdy y'all, I'm around the wheel. You're watching Sea and Sky, comma, Isles of, and quite frankly, probably not for much longer. Uh, because I Summer of Roundy is drawing to a close in a few weeks. I have a few more things I want to look at before then, and I have school to start thinking about and getting ready for. And uh, this kind of game does not make, uh, as they say in certain other industries, a uh, good pod. So I kind of want to just maybe do a couple more things on the ice island and then we're going to call it a wrap on this series, I think. It's a cute game and all, don't get me wrong. It's just, it's just there's a lot going on in it and not all of it makes for, makes for interesting. Okay, actually I have you in the wrong spot. No, that's very bad. Uh, can I get back to where I was from? I'm trying to get the block down in that corner is what I'm trying to do in case it's not obvious. Uh, yeah, I've done many things wrong here, actually. And I actually had the tornado guy in the right place, maybe the first time. So let's back way the truck up. Um, I think I can actually get you there from here, maybe. Yeah, there we go. Okay, that's kind of what I want. So yeah, Isles, Isles of Sea and Sky, not going to go on much longer. It's not, uh, I don't think it's terribly riveting to watch me solve puzzles, even truncating the thought process as much as I do. So we're gonna do a few more things that I think might be possible to do on the island. And then we're gonna get out of here. And I think I have this key. There we go, yes, I've got a key. So let's do that. Let's do a few other things. And then if you like the game, Maybe you should play it for yourself, uh, but otherwise, but other, yeah, I do kind of recommend it. It's a nice little game to sit with. It doesn't always tell you where things are, I think, in the best way, but I don't think it's so good at doing that, quite honestly, but we're going to find a few more things that maybe we can do and then... And then I'm going to say goodbye to Isles of Sea and Sky, uh, which is also going to start kind of closing the curtains on the summer of Roundy. So let's go. OK, here's the musical instrument that we need to be figuring out. Uh, usually there is a note. There's a note uh, that I can touch on this screen. So yeah, moving the moving all of these into position is gonna be a thing. We gotta blow we gotta blow the wind across the okay, six six notes just like usual. Anything anything fancy dancy? Well, okay, we're gonna be playing Zamphir over here. So there is that to be thinking about, possibly. Mayhap. Oh hey. And there's also holes to think about. But where do you take us from here a little bit? Oh, yeah, you were just. Wow. There was a. Uh... There was a big empty launch pad in the corner down there. Does a bird inhabit it if you push on the right rocks? I always think like pushing on rocks is going to do something. It's proven it doesn't actually do a whole lot in this game. But why is there an empty nesting pad there? That's weird. Uh, anyway, let's check out some other things also. Maybe there are other places we can go. Well, this would have been nice to know about a lot sooner. This looks like, okay, can I get this? Oh yeah, I can just walk over. I have a key, I can do it. Okay, so yeah, this would have been nice to what what's the what's the problem okay well there's another note in the pan flute but why can i not open this do i need to have something special this just looked like a normal key block there also looks like something off to the right there that, that rock looks hey okay 
That rock looks really sus. Or that one did, rather. Where are we? Okay. What is all this? Good, next. Okay, yeah, there is still quite a bit we haven't done here, but... Okay, I'm gonna have to figure out what the deal is with that. And there's one of those dark gems. Can I go here? Yeah, I can. And get a star. Holy moly. Where am I? This is crazy. I didn't realize there was this much still to open. Okay, this brings us here. Have I gotten everything on this screen? Except for one star, yeah. Which might be worth doing. Uh, let's see. That takes us here. Which in turn takes us here. Anything? Oh yeah, that's this one. Okay, I remember this. Okay, getting out of here might be a little more doable now. That looks like an egg mound over in the corner. The upper left. What to be what's to be done with the eggs though? Um Okay. But actually we want to go. Okay, that's to that one specifically. Okay. Um can I get down to here from here? Okay, maybe that was not such a good idea taking that particular taking that particular teleporter out of here. I want to get back to where that was and see a little bit more of that. Okay, no, but for real. What actually is going on in this cartoon? Let's go back over here and around here and not through the teleporter this time. This is a pretty crazy little passage right here, actually. Okay, where do you take me? Are you something new as well? Well, I'll be damned. Holy crap. So, can unlock this. Nothing doing here in the meantime. I like how I just talked about pushing rocks not doing anything, and it did something. Oh! Egg incubator of some kind. Okay, so when I find all the eggs and I get them all incubated, then something will happen. I guess that enables the air travel from island to island. Maybe, maybe. I genuinely don't. Wow. Holy crap, there's a lot going on here. Okay, back to this, though. So, all right, come through here. Now, I would almost certainly bet that that, that that, uh, okay, let's see. Can I get down here with ease? Not so much. I would almost bet that cape is for jumping single holes like this one. So if I were to get that somehow, what does this do? Like, what does Dean these bells offer me? Like, I don't, I have to confess, I don't fully understand, but it is a puzzle I feel mildly interested in solving. So whatever I can get on the other side of, I think I'm gonna try. So I do this, I push you up and along however I can. Okay, so no, that's not the bell. That's the thing that dinging the bell. There we go. Well, that's one. That's one bell dingy donged. Oh, it gets me up a screen, obviously. Okay, so going then. No, 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 no. Okay, yeah, we want to go onto this one. Okay, really thought I ruined my chances there for a second. Although, I may have anyway. So, getting up into these little turd holes. Let's see. So yeah, in order to advance a screen, I'm going to have to ring both bells. Oh, Lord, love a duck. How will I accomplish this? Yeah, by pushing them together. That's the smart money. Wait, wasn't it just... Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, wait, no, that's... And again, I'm mixing up the bell and the thing. Like, what's the... What's the... What's the conceit here? What's the... Okay, so now... Now I can't get back... Without without dunking into a hole. So, 
So yeah, I I did both bells. I I don't really understand what that gets me though, other than the complete inability to return to land, because yeah, I'm next to this thing now. I'm rocking out here. Do I need to ding that to be able to touch that rock? Is that what I'm understanding here? But can I get back to there? Did I do this? Did I do this wrongly? Okay, so, like, does pushing on that rock get me or anything, or... What's the... What's the draw here? Can I get around this hole to get this egg mound? Without having the cape, which I'm almost certain does that? Like, I don't... So obviously dinging those bells is important for a reason, but like, but like what reason? Obviously, I feel like it's to get that. Yeah, can't, can't shove on anything. So it's not down here where the important thing is. So come out here. I don't know, do a little of this, a little of that. So, hmm. I feel like, I don't know, I feel like maybe you want to push something to the left. Because, okay, getting around this, you come here, hold on, back, back, back up. Yeah, there's no way to get on this thing's right side not from the current position so so i don't really know what the okay let's let's just do like we were doing for now i'm eliminating a lot of safe walking ground but but i feel like maybe it's fine maybe there's something i'm not seeing here Okay, if I push this, wait, where do I, where can I go from here? Push this left, get on its other side, but then if I just push it up, they're just up against each other and I have no way of getting in here. I feel like I need to push the cloud over the hole so that it fills up with, you know, vapor and whatnot. I'm like halfway, there's like half of the puzzle here that I'm seeing. I don't know what the other half is right now. Okay, so I don't have to ding any bells to get this. So I guess those bells are just a, another way to get on the side of the... Yeah, there's an egg right there. So I guess the bells are just another way to get on the side of the reset... On the other side of the reset block? Huh, weird. Okay. But now I kind of want to find one of those incubators because I think those might be the key to something. So there's one more place... Where there is one more egg mound around here, and I gotta look very carefully for it because I don't know where it is. But I think it should be what I concentrate on so I can get that dang old cape. So I'm gonna go looking for an incubator, uh, one that I have not populated with an egg yet. Is it here? No, not so much. Um, well, then, where? Where, my friends, where?
Okay, there's a second one. There it goes. It's in there. So now I just have to find the third egg mound and the third incubator. Really wish I'd been kind of flagging this stuff at this point. But, you know, what's done is done. Now I just gotta kind of brute force it. Is there anything useful? Are you gonna take me anywhere good? How about you, buddy? No, just right back here. Uh, oh, there it is. Right there, I think, actually. Across from us. It's right here, and it's actually below me. Is there a way to get onto that? Coming from... From where? Okay, so if I get... Okay, no. Coming upstairs ain't gonna do it. Uh, I think that's it right there, but how would I get to it? Except if I had the cake. That's, that's an egg bound. I just slid across it right there in case it's not, like, glaringly obvious. I think I... So, there's the third one. Or maybe there are multiples in other places. Gosh, I hope that's not the only one. Uh, because... How am I getting... How am I getting to that? Okay. So, I would have to come from... The other side okay so i have to come in from the other side got it got it so let's just walk all the way around i saw the opening there all right come here come my lady come come my lady okay wait okay you take me somewhere else how where is the passage to get on the other side of you it's just up the stairs. Okay, it's right here. Let's go around the way and... Oh, egg number three. Now, where is the incubator? Just come around here. Now, I just have to find that infernal machine. Although, I want to kind of go back to... Okay, I can't go back anywhere from... Okay, yeah. I want to go back to that one bird. Where does that one bird take? Because I don't feel like that's a bird that I'm terribly familiar with. You're on the other side of paradise, aren't you? You're not on this side of paradise, you're on the other side. So let's go to ya. Let us go to it and do it. Whatever it may be. Where are you taking me? Are you taking me to an incubator? You better be. Or else I don't know what I'm gonna do. Vaguely threaten you, I suppose? Uh, This looks... Was there one down here? Yeah, here it is. Number three. Oh, look at that. Special airdrop for Mr. Wheel. Okay, so we've got that key. Let's go back. Anything else right now, I'm not super worried about. I'm just worried about getting that cape and calling it a wrap on this one. And I think then what we'll do next time is go on to... I think we'll try to find all the music notes and unlock that secret. And then I think that's really it for puzzles that I want to look at on camera in this game. The rest of the game, I feel like, is better enjoyed to myself. So, wherever that was, it shouldn't be too far a run from here. But we've got a key, and we should be able to... I believe it was just up here, and it should be right downstairs. I believe it's this one, if I remember my albatross ubers correctly. There it is. Cape me up, boys. Time for a fashion. Time for a fashion upgrade. So there we go. Now we've got a cape. Okay, and we can fly over a hole. Uh, maybe not in... No, yeah. Up against a wall, I figured would not be it. Can we go over two holes at once? Or is it just one? Nope, it's just one. But you have enough lift to go over one hole, which should open up some things. Like, um... Like, I know there's at least a couple screens back this way that where we can grab some things. Like, for example, this. We can grab this now. Okay, yeah, I knew I was going to be doing some kind of hole jumping. I knew that was going to be the 
the thrust of what we got up to next. So, okay, now a little more of the island is open to us. There are some things we can grab, but really, as far as major puzzles, there's only one more that I really care about, and it is playing the flute. So, oh yeah, we come over here and we get this switch pressed down. I can get a star. So, I mean, I guess why not try that real... What's over here? Nothing. But I can at least go along these little pathways now. Yeah, there's a star that's accessible because of that. I think if we just come around... Where is the... Where is it? Where are we coming from here? Yeah, I mean, at least there's a, there's at least a few things on here we can grab, which is great and fantastic and wonderful. Come around here. No, I mean, like... I mean, I guess down here. Where is the entry point? To here. I'm trying to trace it. I'm not really... I guess if I get down onto there somehow. Up against a wall, just, yeah, can't do that. Oh, well, anyway, there's more stuff to be gotten. But more importantly, there's a giant flute to be played. So we'll do that next time.